Yeah, we mean business. <laughs> what? You guys didn't mean business before? P give me a break. Just get the fuck out of here so I can grab the sword and go. Not so fast. With Massa's bravery and Mune's knowledge, it's morphin' time! Fusion Ha! Oh my god! What's up guys? This is Mike from Rage Break Gaming, and it is time to head to the Village Report. And let's play Kurano Tiriga. Well, viewers, we met up with Frog again last time, but apparently he's still in a deep depression. Oof. Well, in any case, we've made it to Boy Village, so let's go check it out. See if we can find more information about this hero. Hmm. Do. Oh, damn, that's cheap! 20 gold? <laughs> eh, might as well. Very well then! Good night, viewers. Hashtag Cafe. <laughs> Viewers, Robo, oh my god. Remember how I mentioned last time that Luca, like, takes her glasses off when she sleeps? Robo literally just sits on the bed. He literally just sits on the bed. Wow. I mean, I mean, it doesn't look like much, but when you look at it and con- and, You know what, never mind. I- <laughs> I'm sorry, viewers, that just seemed really, really fucking funny. Or it looked funny. In any case, the magic cave lies under a mountain east of Danadoro? Danadoro? Is that how you pronounce it? Danadoro. Tita, or Tata, received the hero medal. At first, I thought it was fake. He must have done something very brave. He's probably up north looking for the legendary sword. Wait, 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 slow down. So, okay, so now we know that, who, who this legendary hero is. Um, Tata. Tata? That's an odd-ass name. And what's this about a legendary sword? Hmm. Next to the bed is a treasure chest. Open it and the contents are yours. Ooh, thank you. If only I had some jerky. What a great meal I could make. Jerky? Hmm. Viewers, keep this lady in mind for later. Now, obviously, we couldn't give the jerky to her that we got from the head chef at Garden Castle, but there might be a means of getting another piece of Jackie later. Unfortunately, we have more black boxes, but they're still sealed. <sighs> I'm so tired of these damn boxes cock-blocking me! But, you know, whatever. Tata's house. In any case, how's it going, dude? My son's a legendary hero. It must have been it must have been all that oatmeal. And to think that I'm his father. Oh god, I'm so happy. Wow. Hmm. So how did this kid end up becoming a hero anyway? It, it couldn't just be because of some fucking medal. My grandson's a brave hero. That's from my side of the family. <laughs> His mother's side, on the other hand, <laughs> fail. No, <laughs> no, no. But, yeah. I wonder where this Tata kid is. Shut up, phone. Damn it. <laughs> Sorry about that, viewers. Recording in the morning, and obviously I got up before my alarm. Yeah, that was dumb. Hey, it's Toma! How's it going? Hey, you again. How about buying me a soda? Uh... uh Especially considering you barely gave me any real information last time. But, you know, it's worth it. It's worth it because it's a long-term benefit. This is part of a side quest, so you want to buy the soda. Thanks. I wish you a safe journey. <sighs> I tracked down the rainbow shell that the chief wanted. It's on a, some small island. Only thing is, I don't know which island. And the money he gave me is gone. What should I do? How much money did he give you? It must not have been much, especially considering it wasn't that long ago that I just last saw you. What did you do with it in all that time? Get drunk at the pub? It makes... Wait, wait, what? I can't believe that legendary hero was that naughty runt Tata. 
Wait a minute. So this legendary hero is a kid? Bruh. Well, there you go. <laughs> Have you heard about the magical cave, the one east of the Dono Mountains? I saw a rock wall there pop open, and a gaggle of ghouls just walked right in. Ghoul, ghouls and ghosts? No, no. Best to leave Megas and his cronies alone, though. Hmm, I wonder if that's Megas' lair. I can't believe, I can't believe the legendary hero was a boy from this village. Did you hear the latest? Yeah, I did. Everyone's talking about him. I bet his old man is proud. <laughs> Probably can't sleep at night being so proud. A strange monster came by the other day mumbling about Queen Lean and the Masamune. That sure were an ugly frog, hearty har. Hmm. Obviously talking about frog there. Frog was so depressed he went to the pub to get drunk. But apparently, um All he did was just get um like Oh my god, you're so ugly! Gag! Like, this. wow. In any case, now, check it over here, viewers. It's called the Magic Cave that that one person was talking about. Now, there's nothing we can do here yet, but keep it in mind for later because it will become a plot point later, just so you know. For now, though, we need to find this supposed legendary hero kid. Let's head to the, um, Donadoro Mountain to see what we can find. In any case, of course we got monsters here, obviously. WAKE UP! No! <laughs> Yay! We got more bellbirds. We also got a new enemy here. Goblins! Gobbledy gooks. Um... Where, where the fuck are they? I am looking at the right thing, right? Goblin, goblin. Hmm, that's weird. I don't see it on here. Well, either way, it's going, it's going down. One part of my note says he, they're weak to fire, so I would probably go with that. Mech Cyclone! Damn, that's a lot of damage! Fucking A. Burn, bitch! <laughs> yeah, I know one thing about the goblins. They are weak as shit to fire. Fire! It burns! Literally. Oh yeah, you definitely want to have Luca in this in, in your main party for this place because yeah, we're gonna be running into those goblins like a lot. So, eh. In any case, uh, did we hear this music before? Oh yeah, that's right, the underground um the sewer back in the um the future. In any case, ah, huh? What's going on? Whoa! Whoa, shit! Don't worry, kid, I'll save ya. In any case, let's get this goblin out of here. Ow! Fuck off, bitch! Ha! That demon is just something fucking else. <laughs> A crit of 700 damage. Fuck me. Mm. You alright, kid? This is a terrible place. You best run away while you can. Huh. Oh, come on! Huh. In any case, we got another new enemy here. Ogon. Now, I actually have his notes. Huh, um, 146 HP. He's weak to fire, just like the goblins. So, who cares? Fire Sado! Burn! The fuck? Oh, oh yeah, that's right. I forgot about that mechanic. Rocket the pooch! Now the thing is, with those Ogons, you want to burn away their um their clubs first. Once you burn their clubs, their defense will be lowered, and that's when you can lower the boom. So, just so you know. But yeah, I assume that kid was that Tata kid. I mean. I don't think there's any other kid that would be roaming around in this place with all these fucking goblins and shit around. That'd be kind of odd. Like, where the fuck are your parents? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Wait, was that trash? Yeah, I almost missed it. It blended in with the area. Yes, a mirage hand. That's a new weapon for Robo. All right. Let's give it to our robot. Yay! 
Alright, moving on with life. In any case, we gotta catch up to Tata and see if we can try and keep him out of trouble. Because, you know, he is a kid thinking he's a hero. And he's going into an area. Oh, you know what? First of all, I wonder if the night captain and his men knew that they were, you know, talking to a kid and stuff like that. Saying he's the legendary hero. He could have just been, um, you know, some kid. The fuck? Hey, dude. Hmm. I guess do not disturb. Oh! Wake up, bitch! We got enemies. <laughs> dude just fucking threw a rock at him. In any case, new enemy here, Freelancer. Where are you at? 110 HP. They have no weakness. So yeah, just like before, you want to burn away the Ogon's, um, you know, axe. Because if not, his defense will be up super hard. Did that guy just throw a shortcut at me? Wow, so he's a ninja. He's a ninja! He's a spy! Ha! And oh yeah, spin cut. Chrono's new single target attack deals times two the normal amount of damage. So it is, you know, super nice. Get the fuck out of my way, bitch. Now you can sleep permanently. <laughs> Nice. Random as shit. <laughs> but nice, though. Oh, by the way, I already came from here. Dude, respawn that quick? Wow. Well, there you go. Wow. <laughs> the thing is, now, when I was doing my, my, um, my tech point grinding and stuff like that before the last episode... I thought about going back into the Hecron cave to do that. But when I went back in there, the fucking place was, um, deserted. There weren't even any monsters in there. I guess killing Hecron must, all the monsters that were in there, you, you went like, you know what, fuck this shit. <laughs> I ain't dealing with these fucking humans. Death to the mystics enemies! Pretty much. Boom! Bye bye. I don't even need the goblins' um, HP totals to know that they're shit. So, yeah. So, now that I think about it... Mm, no, no. I was thinking of equipping Luca with the, um... The, um... Sight scope. As a matter of fact, I think I'll give it... I think I'll give it to Robo temporarily. So, I'll, I'll take him off the power gloves. Not that big a deal. Um... Oh, right, I gave it to Marley. Shit. <sighs> now I gotta bring Marley in to get it. Sorry, Marley, I still I can't have you in for this one because I need Luca in here and I need Robo. So, you know. I'll bring you back in another time, so don't you fucking worry. Marley is going to be boss later in the game. Trust me on this. In any case, back to Luca. All right, now we're good. Get that money. No, uh, no game. Fuck me. I need to learn how to do these buttons better. Cause I suck ass at it. I suck ass at Chrono Trigger on on a on a controller. But I I remember playing it a lot on my keyboard, and it wasn't this fucking annoying. <sighs> Super Nintendo, um, you know, button configurations for you and shit. So yay. Whoa! Trying to give a dude a heart attack, dude? Damn. Well, just for that, I'm going to burn your ass. Fire burn! Hold still, bitch! <laughs> Slice and dice! There you go. Some just can't wait to die. <laughs> that dude thought he was going to do a sneak attack on me. You're doing a sneak attack, bruh, on a group of three people. A party of three people. Do you honestly, in your life, do you honestly think you would be able to get off a sneak attack on three people and not expect to get your ass kicked? Come on now. Please do not be dumb. Do not be dumb. Because Arceus knows we have more than enough dumbasses in the world already. In any case, another freelancer. 
Ninja! There you go. That dude's a spy! And we know how to deal with spies, don't we, viewers? We hack and slash their ass. We put a bullet in their ass. We put a cap in that ass. Tap that ass. Uh, no, 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 no. Not being said, though, we throw napalm men at their asses. <laughs> Who needs crowd control when you got Luca on your side? Yay! She is the scientist, after all. In any case, get a revive here. Yeah! Alright, where is this kid? He couldn't have gone that far so quickly. Hmm. Got another gold helm. Give that to Robo. Or can I give that to Luca? No, she can't even. Of course she can't equip it. Oh, but she can equip an iron helm, right? But she can't equip the gold helm? Huh. Sexist body armor! No, no. Probably. You never know. This was made in the, in the late 90s. <laughs> but... You never know! You never know! Just saying, just saying. In case, this bitch out of here. Burn his, um, his wood. Yeah, the hammer, not the actual. You know what wood I mean. Spin cuts! That's not much of a spin. I don't know why they call it spin cuts. You might as well just call that at, um, you know what? No, no. I was about I was about to suggest spiral cut. <laughs> I was about to suggest spiral cut, but no. I was trying to make a reference to um you know to Titus's um um overdrives in Final Fantasy X. Underbolt! There you go. That bitch out of here. But yeah, it would it wouldn't have mattered in this context. Get out of here, bitch! All right, he still has his hammer on him. Who cares? There you go. Huh. Who cares about your hammer when I could just fast forward through the entire fight? There you go. Simple and easy for me. Uh, remember how low we were on ethers earlier in the game, and now we have more than enough to last us till we can actually get to a shop that sells them. Uh. Actually, now that I think about it, the shop in Madonna Village did sell those, right? Even though I know the monster that was in charge of the shop was charged... The fuck? Even though I know the monster in charge of the place was, like, over overpricing it because he doesn't like me. Hmm, whatever. This dude is throwing rocks at me! Oh, I'm gonna kick your ass. Get over here! Bruh, I can't even attack him. That's bullshit. Well, you know what? Don't worry about it, because I'll come and get your ass later. Trust me. Oh, but I'll take care of your friends first. After all, viewers, birds of a feather kind of often die together. Don't you think? Well, I know. Spin cuts! Boom! This bitch out of here. Napalm Man! There you go. Napalm Man was able to throw bombs, right? I, it's been a, it's been a while since I played Mega Man 3. I am planning on doing um, Mega Man 3 again. Now that I think about it, like, I'm sure those of you that have been long, sub to me long enough, shut up phone. I'm sure that those of you who have been sub to me long enough know that I will try to do a Mega Man 3 LP on the channel, but I never got to finish it. But I am planning on revisiting it, probably starting it over again, you know, starting it over from scratch. I didn't really get that far into it to begin with. Ooh, a rainbow! Make a wish, viewers. Taste the rainbow. Feel the rainbow. Mmm, yes. But in any case, uh-oh. Anim <coughs> Enemies! There you go. I did go over the Bellbird's HP, right? I, I, I could have sworn we fought this guy earlier in the game. Whatever. Fire World! There you go. Not that it matters. He only has 94 HP. He's weak as shit. So it doesn't matter. Now! Falcon Punch! Yay! But yeah, I will be doing Mega Man 3 as a side LP at some point in the, um... You know. Whoa! Ooh! 
scared the shit out of me in the near future. And then again, ooh, this is exactly what I was looking for. The silver stud. You're such a stud. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you very much. In any case, the silver stud is nice, cuts MP uses by 50%. This is boss. Um, the problem is, I don't know who to fucking give it to. Hmm, I'd probably give it to Chrono more so because I've been, I use his text like a lot anyway. But then again, I could give this to one of my manges. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I'll keep it on hand, but you definitely want to get the silver stud because that'll be useful later in the game. Well, until we get the gold stud, which we'll be getting that too. You know, the brother to the silver stud. We only got the sister to, um, we got the sister of the gold stud. So, there you go. We get the silver earring. But of course, where there's silver, there is also gold. Am I right? You know I am. Max HP up by 25%. That's not bad. You should give that to one of the ladies because you know their a you know their HP sucks ass, right? Of course you do. Um <laughs> I mean it, it, as if that's a shock. In any case, can't even go down from here. Alright, just gotta make my way back up again. But yeah, their HP is similar to like um uh like Ivan and Sheba's from the Golden Sun games. Oh, come on. <sighs> Alright, viewers and Mac, we're back in this section again. Oh, boy. Why did I go back through that fucking forest? That was dumb of me. Okay, let's get the mid tonic here. Let's continue on with life. Is this the bastard that was. No, I don't think he's the one. Well, while he's practicing his sword play, I'll, you know, get past him. See ya, bro. Uh Where do you think you're going? I was going away from you. Too bad. Time to die. <laughs> the only one dying here is you. 360 dead ass. There you go. Hmm. Stupid ass bird ninjas. You give ninjas a bad name. Uh, Speccio, is that you? Mountains are nice. Uh, okay, I guess that's not Speccio. <laughs> Just a monster that looks like Speccio. Specchio has a lot of clones. Hmm. Then again, I'm sure that's not Specchio's real form. Something tells me it isn't. I don't know. Could be just a hunch. <laughs> that being said, though. Ah, come over here. Get a mid ether. Nice. All right, moving on with life. Um, was there a tab? Oh, viewers, viewers, um... We gotta go back to that Speccio lookalike. I, wow, I almost missed it. We gotta talk to him like four times. That's the life. Mountains are nice. Man, you're noisy. Here, take this. Yay, a magic tab. Thank you. Thank you, bro. All right, we got the magic tab. Perfect. Um, there you go. Oh yeah, we got this power meal. I forgot where I got that from. It recovers you from the question mark status hmm. I think I remember what that is but I, I can't put it into uh, you know what I you know what never mind I don't even remember what it does but I know that is a status element we'll be dealing with in like the middle point of the game so yeah I, I'm sure I'll remember it when I actually get hit with it uh shiny I see it yay a speed tab I almost missed that too because it blended in so well with the surroundings. In any case, my speed tabs obviously are going to be given to Robo. As if you had any doubt, viewers? <laughs> Who the fuck else am I giving it to? I ain't giving it to Chrono. Yo. Oh, this bitch! Come on, dude, so I can kick your ass! Bitches literally. You know what? Come on! Ugh, fuck you. Whoa! Uh -oh. Shit, I woke up the beast. Nuts. <sighs> Whatever, just more goblins. Get him out of here! There you go. Fucking stupid ass, dumb ass uh, uh, monsters. Whoa! You know what? You're pissing me off! It's time to it's time to end this. Oh shit! He had backup dancers. 
gag. In any case, yeah. You know what? You die first. I'm I'm done with you. Get this out of here first. There you go. Now, thunderbolts. You bitch. <laughs> Serves you fucking right. But yeah, napalm their asses. <laughs> you burnt my nuts. Laser spin. Nice. Not bad. Ow. You're, you really think your puny ass little knife can even do anything to a robot? Bitch, get out of here. Thunderbolts! <laughs> Burn, bitch! And get out of my face. There you go. Get out of my face! Yay! Level up. Huh. Well, viewers, I got my revenge on that fucking ninja chicken. So, all's well with the world. Yes. What? What the hell? Why are there kids in here? That's weird. Well, I don't know what the fuck's going on, but I'm going to heal first before anything does happen. Probably nothing, though. Hmm. As a matter of fact, let me save state, too. Be right back. All right, viewers of Mac, I brought Marley in. Why? Well, you'll find out soon enough. I mean, I seriously doubt the kids are going to give us trouble. In any case, why are you in here? I'm the wind! Whoosh! Why is a kid playing in a, in a mountain cave in an area full of monsters? Where are your parents at? Parents are so lazy these days, just letting their kids do whatever the f they want to do. Stop! Huh? Damn, that kid can jump. Are you here for the Masamune? Wait, the Masamune exists? Wow. Uh, I wasn't going for it, but now that I see it, yeah, I want it. <laughs> Thought so. Wait a second, okay? Oh, big brother! Oni-chan! <clears throat> Oni-chan! Where are you, Massa? <gasps> what the fuck? What is it, Mune? Ah! Not again! So, you want to get a name for yourself by grabbing the Massa, Mune? What a buffoon! Who the hell are you calling a buffoon? Wait a minute! Wait, 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 wait. These kids are named Massa and Mune after the sword? Uh... This is interesting. Humans are so... Silly. How... It's how you use the sword that's important, not who owns it. What do you mean by humans are so silly? You're humans yourselves! Aren't you? <laughs> you can't even understand something as simple as that. That's why you're human. And that's why you're a little prick. What should we do? The usual. Test them. You can entertain us for a while while we kick your ass. <laughs> what can you two little um twerps do to me? Alright, here we go. Whoosh! What the? Whoa! Looks like they're not twerps after all. They are monsters. Cause it's time for a boss fight versus Massa and Mune. Now, Massa and Mune both have 1,000 HP. They have no weaknesses. So, it really doesn't matter what the fuck you do. But I recommend going after them one at a time. One, actually, no. Take out one and the other one will will go down too. Fire Heh, <laughs> 669. Nah. Whoa! Wait, that was X-Strike! I thought I was the only one in the game that could use tech attacks. Bruh! Whoa! Oh, God. Ooh, Luca? Luca, what the fuck are you doing? Oh shit, she's confused! Let's end this fight! Metal Sword! Huh, that was easy. Apart, Master and Mune are powerless. Pretty much. That was too easy. Looks like you're just twerps after all. You don't even have to be humans. Hey, they're pretty tough. 
<laughs> Only Cyrus made it this far. Who the hell is Cyrus? Hmm, what should we do? Hmm, this time is for real. Alright, this is it. Yeah, we mean business. <laughs> what, you guys didn't mean business before? P give me a break. Just get the fuck out of here so I can grab the sword and go. Not so fast! With Massa's bravery and... Mune's knowledge... It's morphin' time! Fusion Ha! Oh my god! That's a big ass, fat ass monster! So it's time for a boss fight! Versus Massa and Mune combined! Now, Massa and Mune combined, 3600 HP! Now, he has no weakness outside of Chrono's slash attack, surprisingly enough. So yeah, the thing is, will Chrono slash attack? Whoa! Ow! Chrono slash attack can actually dissipate a, a move of his. So that's why you want to use slash on it. That's his only real weakness in this fight. It's powered! Outside of that, use whatever attacks and dual attacks you want. He doesn't have any real uh, attacks other than what he has. So yeah, when he starts storing energy, use the slash attack. That'll neutralize his tornado energy. If not, you're going to have to deal with a shit ton of damage that I don't think you'll want to have to deal with. So, yeah, pretty much. Now, let's do this. I saw the... Nice. Just have to keep up to sit on the dual text between your party members. Having both Luca and Marley in the party for this is actually good because you can just use their attacks combined with Chrono. I saw a fire sword, it doesn't really have to, it doesn't matter. But <laughs> 69. But yeah, I think I might just stick to Ice Sword and have Luca be the, um, the primary healer. Slash attacker. Slash DPS. Slash, slash jack of all um, scientists. Pretty much. Her napalm deals some good damage, so. I have no qualms about having her be the healer. Marley actually needs to put in some work for a change, so that's why I'm having her, well, put in some work. Now, Ice Sword! Suck my ice, bitch! <laughs> nice. That should be about, uh, like, like, 2k, 1.2k damage. Oh, shit! Um, Slash! Where is it? Hurry up! Yeah, get that bitch out of here. Shit out of here, bruh. Alright, get my ether. Alright, let's wait to get back to Chrono's turn. Look at him! Viewers, you, you see his stance? Like, like he's some kind of boxer. <laughs> I like that. Mike Tyson and Chrono Trigger. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I don't want to piss. Oh! Oh, I was about to say, please don't attack alone, Luca. <laughs> Well, yeah, I probably pissed off some t Mike Tyson fans in the audience. Oops! Might be. Damn, don't, you don't have to get all pissy. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Jeez. Otherwise than that, though. All right. Whoa! I got him! <laughs> he died to a critical, um, a counterattack. Wow. Wow, that's the way the sword, the... Uh, Fat monster crumbles. Yay! Maybe he ate all the crumbles. Hmm. Maybe that's why I don't have any more. They beat us, big bro. That was fun! <laughs> I wanna go again! I wanna go again! Uh, no. No. Calm, calm down, little, um... Little bastard. <laughs> Will they fix us? We, will they find us an owner? The fuck does that mean? Well, you know what? Never mind. I I, I don't even want to have that out of context. That, that that didn't sound right. Yeah, it'll be all right. Where are you going? They they went into the sword. What the oh. What do they mean by fix us, though? What? 
the hell? Is that the blade of the sword? So this is the Masamune. But it looks like it's been broken for ages. We got the broken Masamune. So it was broken this whole time? What the hell? Allow me. We'll ride the wind to the base of the mountain. Good luck to you. Uh, thank you for the bro down. I appreciate it, you guys. Thanks for the lift. Out of here. Whew. Now that was some mountain adventure. <laughs> wow, that was random as fuck. Well, there you go. Well, now that we got the Masamune, where did Tata go? I almost forgot about the kid. And now that we got the Masamune, I wonder what Frog would say if we give it back to him. Hmm, let's find out next time! You guys enjoy, you know what to do. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel for Gaming Biz for me. And of course, when you subscribe, be sure to hit the bell to notify them of my newest uploads. Got something to say? Of course you do. Leave a comment, duh. Till next time, dudes and dudettes, this is Mike from Rage Break Gaming. I hope your rage breaks. Have a great day, my bitches and bros. Smell you later.